Hi everybody, it's Cam Kiel, and today I'm gonna show you how the program made by Elba works. Uh, it allows you to do Ctrl J with a single key. In the description of the video, there's two download link for the program. One that allows you to make the Ctrl J with the A key, and the other that allows you to make the Ctrl J with the zero key from the numpad. Download the one you want. Once you've downloaded it, you just have to open it in administrator mode. If you did all the steps correctly, you should see a green square with a H in it just here. Now you can start the game and I'll show you how it works on the server of the 8th. For this video, I'll be helped with three people Tenitz and Greg from the 8th. Salut! Salut! And my good friend Atlas, who's holding the flag. Bonsoir! I've downloaded the first software, and now if I press A, that's what happened. As you can see, it works perfectly. There's also a mode that allows you to make an infinite loop of Ctrl J. Now I asked Greg to join me. Yep. You just have to hit end. Okay, at last you can give the go. Est-ce que vous êtes prêt? Yes. Allez, go! I just want to specify that Greg doesn't have the software. As you can see, I'm ahead of Greg, and I'm not using my keyboard anymore, I just pressed once. As you can see, it's made for trolling. You can use your trumpet or your sword at the same time without using your keyboard. To stop the infinite loop, just need to press delete. One thing you should know, the script is activated by default. You can have some problems if you want to send message in-game or on Steam. You have to disable the script and for that press page up. And to reactivate the script press page down. If you have any question feel free to leave any comment. If you want another key than A or 0, I'm gonna show you how to change it. Let's go! For this you just need to download the auto -out key software. There is a download link in the description of the video. Once it's downloaded, run the setup, choose custom installation, then choose Unicode 32 to avoid conflict. Here you can choose where you want to install it. Keep the first one but unselect the two last choice and click install. The setup is over and you have the software. Right click on your desktop, go to new and then select auto -hot key script. You have to enter the name of the software. It's Elbars Control J. Once it's done, right click on your file, choose Edit Script, delete all the text, copy paste the script that is in the description below the video. Now you are ready to modify your script. I'm gonna explain you what it does line by line. Don't worry about the four first lines, go to the fifth. This line means that the script only works if Mountain Blade is running. Here you have the page up and page down key that allows you to stop and start the script. You can change them. Okay, so we're gonna choose I to suspend the script and O to activate it. As you can see, this is the script with the zero activation. If you don't want A and you don't want zero to activate the script, for example, you want F instead, I've also got it for the numpad insert, so if your num lock is not activated, it still works. This is the key to do the infinite control J. Let's say we want V. You can see that there is a loop. That means that from here to here, the software is gonna hit J non-stop. The only way to break the loop is to press delete. If you want to change the key to stop the loop, don't forget the star at the beginning of the line. The star allows you to do two actions at the same time. Choose what you want. Once you're done, save and close. Right click your file and select run as administrator. Congratulations, your script is started. If you want to gain some time, right click your file and select compile. This is gonna give you a .exe file. The same script but with few modifications. Now you just have to run the compile file as administrator. Alba, give this 
for free for the Mountain Blade community. You can modify and share it, but don't forget to mention that Elba made it. Last info, the 8th is recruiting English speakers. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment, Elba gonna answer you. And I hope to see you again for another tutorial. Goodbye!